بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم نحمده ونصلي على رسوله الكريم so in the last lesson we discussed translating uh, categorical or normal statements into categorical propositions yes because that's how we work so you need to translate normal sentences into categorical propositions and then today we're going to learn about how do we depict these in venn diagrams just to uh, have a diagram or a picture of understanding of what we're talking about so here so let's really have an example all muslims are monotheist what kind of uh, proposition is this okay. it's an a proposition because we have it's affirmative and it's universal correct now we can say here we draw one circle yes that's the muslims and another circle to say monotheist yes so for a second and what we'll do we what will will erase the area which doesn't exist which area doesn't exist in here huh this one yeah so if you go over here that doesn't exist you understand fully it makes sense and so so now we do like this we cross that area you can now we can shade it out we put the black here so now we know so all muslims are in the monotheist area yes because no muslim exists exist outside the monotheism no muslim a polytheist what polytheist monotheist means believe in one god and polytheist means what believe in multiple gods so no muslim a polytheist what kind of proposition is this e proposition because it's universal and negative so we have here muslims and polytheists what, what are we going to shed out in here the middle why the middle because muslims can't overlap with polytheism in any form so how we draw it so far so good then we have one some muslims are hanafis some muslims follow the hanafi school of thought fiqh so how, what is this going to be what kind of proposition is this a e is an i because it's it's, it's uh, affirmative but what is it particular not referring to the entire category so we have the muslims and we have the hanafis and what we do here now we can't share anything out we just put an x in here no so here we just put one x in here and we'll say what here what do you have here that we know for a fact that at least because some can mean 99% or 0.1% or 1% 99% it can both in it some in in logic is means not all So we can say here that what we know for sure is that some Mus- some Muslims fall under the Hanafi. So they're Muslims within the Muslim circle, but they're also within the Hanafi circle. How many of it? We can't say all. We can't say none. We just know that there is. We have Hanafis that Muslims, not Muslim. Hanafis are not Muslim. The Hanafis are not followers. No, but all Hanafis are Muslims. So that means you can't. Yeah, but see, yeah. So we shave out, shave out, shave shit out the Hanafis. It's not Muslims. In this example, it work, but we want to. We can't deduce that definitely. It doesn't work in all examples. We're looking for a, a, a rule, a general rule that applies throughout. So, for example, in here, you you can't have a Hanafi not Muslim, but in another proposition where some, and in other e propositions, you can have people that also fall in here. Not in this one. It won't work in here. Wouldn't make sense. Or let's say, for example, there's a hypocrite. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Some Muslim. Yeah. So yeah. So some Muslims are Indian. Let's say here. Let's say some Muslims are Indian. Some Muslims are Indian. If you do that, that yes. If you take a Hanafi and put here Indian, it will work. See how you see how how the problem occurs. So see, that's what I'm saying. You can't look at that one rule. Is that applying that? See, in the Hanafi one, you could have shaded it out and said, "Well, all Hanafis are Muslim, but that wouldn't work." That's not, that's not a rule for E proposition. E, e, not E, an I proposition. The rule is you can only know this is what we know. Sorry, this is this only this works for, for sure. This is uncertain. In one proposition, it worked, and one it didn't. Do you understand? And if you have an A E I, if in an O proposition, some Muslims are not Hanafis. How where, where we put X? We put X. I'm used to my mother's one. Put the X in here. You know, some Muslims are not Hanafis. Whether what's in the other thing, we can't. Yes. So that's a simple rule of how we diagram. That we'll need this a bit more when we go into in the next few lessons. We'll we we'll see what the benefits of this are. So this is the way you can depict vi- visually depict the propositions. We have we translated normal statements into propositions, and you can depict propositions as Venn diagrams. Yes. So far, so good. Okay. Let's stop here, inshallah. Subhanallah. Bihamdi. Subhanallah. Bihamdi. Kalushadu la ilaha illa Allah. Nasakhir. Nadubu ilaika.